such a nice piece. It's oh, nice. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. Now I got it in my hands finally. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today the first thing we do is a little transformation um, because I've decided I want to get extensions. Uh, my hair was once so beautiful and long <laughs> and then I was like basically bleaching it for five years, right? And since even though I went back to my original hair color now, it's weak, it breaks, you know, it's not the best. So we're gonna get extensions today. I'm really, really excited. And then we go on a little shopping trip afterwards. Oh. Yeah, I wanna see like how, how it's gonna change later and then we see the yes. full result. Yeah. So we just might as well yeah, it's true. I mean, that would nice. be. I thought I would just want it to be dark, but I mean, this is more interesting, right? Yeah. Hmm, what do we think? Yeah, guys, okay, so the review. Absolutely love it so, so much. Let me know what you think. I, I am ready. I think that was the best idea actually to put some blonde extensions in it. I think it's a really nice contrast, isn't it? Let me know what you think. Yeah, okay guys, so I really could not be any happy. I have to say that I've got long hair again <laughs> I feel like a little girl. Um, I really wanted to have long hair for so so long You can't even imagine how happy I am at the moment. So yeah, we are done even though this took like three hours now <laughs> Let's head to Selfridges to Oxford Street today and just see what we find and then yeah, I need a bubble tea. Okay guys, so here we are at Oxford Circus in the evening well, at dusk, <laughs> and it is so incredibly beautiful. I still can't get over the fact that they have the Christmas decoration up in the middle of October. It's not a bubble tea, but it's a hot chocolate. <laughs> I needed a quick fix. Um, yeah, however, so we're on Oxford Street now, going to Selfridges, and I can't wait to see what they have, because I haven't been there in a while. So I'm just walking past Zara, and I have been complaining for the longest time now that they don't have anything fancy anymore, that they don't have anything elegant. And I have to say, maybe lockdown time is finally over, and we get to see some extra really nice outfits again. I can't wait to look at this. This looks very Hollywood. Very Hollywood glamour love it. So we're here at Selfridges and it looks like Prada has a winter pop-up area here in Selfridges. That looks exciting. Let's go in. Yeah, so where do we start? I think let's start at Fendi. Um, I don't know if my is here. I absolutely love her. I hope she is, Patricia. We're gonna go look for her for sure. But first, let's see what's on the window. No, not window display, what's on display. <laughs> it's, a, it's been a long day, people. Um, and I haven't eaten that much. I only had my hot chocolate. <laughs> okay, so, ooh, this is a new design, right? We have not seen this before. I like the sleek lines that Fendi is using at the moment. I mean, their, their clothing um, line is absolutely divine, right? Oh, look at these teeny tiny little. Fendi Peekaboo's, their clothing line is of course absolutely divine and like we always say they're really killing it at the moment right um, but even their bags I think yeah I absolutely love everything Fendi I think we have to go behind the glass to actually see all of these bags um, but yeah let me show you what's here I've seen this before I absolutely love the metal work on this one gorgeous okay I think we have to go around quickly to be able to appreciate all of these bags. Yeah, definitely always let me know um, whenever something catches your eye. Um, I wonder if they have the new toads that we saw at Harris last time, because I would love to try one of those. How about we try that one? I think that's pretty. Um, they actually have it in the baguette as well. I think that's new designs I've not seen yet. Okay, so they don't have the Fendi Toad here uh, in Selfridges at the moment. It's actually sold out, that beautiful black one, if you can remember it from my last vlog. However, I've just spotted this tiny little peekaboo and it is so, so cute. I mean, usually I don't like the logos, especially if they're that big and all over the bag, but I think this is a very subtle version, isn't it? Um, and I think it's the perfect bag for like autumn and winter. So cute, let me know what you think. So Prada, anything catching our eye? I have to say I never, I never get excited when I see Prada bags, unfortunately. To be honest, the quality is not the best either. Yeah, so what do we think about these outfits? Let me know. Of course, the leopard print is everywhere nowadays. Let's see what's new. 
here we have, I can't wait, actually, maybe I can already tell you that my cousin Milena is coming very soon to actually visit me. Oh, this is a beautiful turquoise. This is such a beautiful turquoise color, isn't it? Um, so my cousin Milena is actually coming very soon and she's visiting me here and I'm pretty sure there are some bags on her wish list. So that will be a beautiful, exciting weekend vlog that we're gonna do and I hope oh this is really nice for autumn and winter and well isn't it yeah so I hope that we get so so much footage once Milena is here and we can do a little big sister little sister shopping vlog <laughs> um, I can't wait some of you might actually still remember her from a couple months back <laughs> when I was in Germany and I visited my family and I really can't wait. I'm so happy that the UK is open again and that people can come visit me. Ooh, this is really nice as well. Let's hope the world finally goes back to normal very soon. Oh wow, and even more eye candy. Um, that is pretty gorgeous, isn't it? Look at these ones, so pretty, <laughs> no worries. Um, absolutely gorgeous. I love it, to be honest. Maybe it's just my love for little puffy bags. <laughs> um, that's always overcoming me now. Interesting, isn't it? Let me know if anything caught your eye. Guys, look at this. They even make mini Lady Dior's for the art series now. We're gonna have a look at them after they're done. So here we are with a beautiful shearling bag. And I mean, I can't really put it over my cape now, but you get the idea. It is so nice. It's actually, you said a cottony material, right? Did you say it's a cottony material? Ah, okay. Yeah, perfect. That's nice. I think it looks like shirling, but it's not shirling, which would be even better, of course, um, if it's actually just cotton. It just looks like a little cloud, right? It is absolutely cute. And let's look inside. Oh, it's shirling. Okay, it's actually shirling. <laughs> I was like, that looks good for non shirling. <laughs> um, it's so nice. What is this? Sweet? Is this uh, an... it is sheepskin. Oh, sheepskin. Okay. Yeah. Beautiful. Tell me anything about this. Um, so this is the collaboration with Olga. Yeah. So all the details here yeah, you can see, you yeah. know, like it's all... Like, beaded. It's yeah. All beaded. Oh my god. And the hardware is beautifully hammered, right? Yeah. It's like a... And you know, like it's gold here. Yeah. And it's very different from the... Um, Foundation yeah, table. yeah, okay. it is. That's the most beautiful hardware I think I've ever seen. <laughs> wow, it is pretty heavy, you're right. But I yes, mean, because like, you know, all details, you know, like handmade. I mean, this is probably only to be displayed, right? Um, if I would, if somebody was gonna wear it, would it rub off? I mean, this like um, for for us, we do have the policy of two years warranty, yeah, yeah. so yeah. you know, all of these will be you know perfectly like okay. Um, check and everything before yeah. we wrap it up. Wow, it's so, so gorgeous. Okay guys, I am absolutely in love. It's one of a kind. They only have one of this, these bags in the entire world. I can't believe this. Usually for the art collections, I mean, they always make a couple at least. But oh, is this not the most gorgeous bag? <laughs> I don't know, I didn't, I didn't expect to find something so beautiful today. You know why this mm -hmm. bag is this black lambskin? And all of the crystal and pearls here are hand embroidered. Wow, yeah, yeah. It's absolutely gorgeous. I can't believe there's only one, right? It's yes. Such a rare piece then. Yeah, somebody else already interested in the other one. Yes. <laughs> I mean, I can understand. Okay, so what do we so have here? This one is the couture bag. Mm -hmm. So it comes out from the couture, you know, it's from Suki. Yeah. And you can see the, you know, the stitches yes. here is very different from, you know, other yeah. sort of like yeah. 80 to normal. It's gorgeous. And, it only, and this color only comes with the mini size. Okay, yeah. And this is champagne gold, right? Yes, yes. champagne gold. Okay, and what do we have here? Wow, the handles. I personally love this one. Uh -huh. I love it so much because this one is, uh, yes, as I said, another Lady Dior bag. Yes, beaded as well. Beaded as well, hand beaded. Mm -hmm. um, it's in lambskin. Yeah. And you can see, you know, like it's all about the detail. Yeah. From black yeah. yeah. Let's look at the metal here. This is yes, okay. absolutely. And it is actual stone here, so the top handle is a little bit heavy. Oh wow! Okay, actual stone. So are these made of the same material, the yes. hardware? Wow! Look at this. This is absolutely stunning. Okay, I would say let's try them all. So this is, I think, the heaviest Lady Dior I've ever tried on, even though it's a mini size, right? Yes, yeah, so it is. It is, you said it's made out of stone? Yeah. Wow, so the handles are made out of stone. That is so incredible. The hardware is made out of the same material. 
wow, it really feels like a break, but it's such a work of art. Um, do these um, artist versions come with a shoulder strap as well? Yes. Okay, okay, they do come with a shoulder strap. Absolutely stunning. I mean, I still prefer the colorful one, I think. I think the colorful one is very nice. It is, like, right? It pops out. It does, it really does. It Let's give you a very, you know, like, yeah. very baby, very lady sort of Yeah, thing, and like. let's try this one on as well. Of course. Okay, what do we have here? What the hardware is just made out of? This is lambskin. Yeah, this uh, is lambskin. Umbrella. Oh, true. And the hardware? Do we know anything about this? Is it just made out of? Um, um so this mud? is like just the plastic. Um, plastic. Okay. Mango. Yeah. So this is the green one. It is absolutely such a beautiful piece as well. Although my heart, I think, belongs to the little, you know, the colorful one. Um, this has such a nice ombre effect. So it's not only the sequence, right? Can we see that in the light that show the ombre effect? It's also the handle. Um, let me know which one you prefer the most. I think there's one more. I don't know if we get to see it here, but I asked. I know we tried this one on already, but actually because I told her that I like this one, she just brought it and said, hey, maybe you like that one too. So let's just have another quick look at it. It is cute. I said it last time in my vlog already. I absolutely love it. It is very cute. Um, it's the perfect, like, everyday, little comfortable, you know, everyday companion basically for autumn and winter um, it does look bigger than a mini than a regular mini simply because of the material they used what do we think what material did they use is this um the little this is metal yeah metal uh, it looks almost like the the things from a bottle right yes oh. <laughs> That's wow. why you see you have the thingy here, you ah, know, like the, oh, okay. the, 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 the cat opening. Wow, <laughs> and then they have one of the silver ones. Nice. Yes, it's all about the detail. Yeah, beautiful. Yeah, let's try this one on too. Yes, it's you. a bit heavy. So this is number four, of course. It is a very special piece. It is again incredibly heavy simply because it is full with metal basically um, but I think my heart got stolen by that little colorful one so maybe we should have another look at that it's 9,000 pound I think let me ask her again Hold that magic with this? yeah Is yeah that a and it's even hammered here as well right yeah. Beautiful. And you see the details here as well? Yeah, yeah. So it's different from the It's classic. definitely different. Yeah. Okay guys, so there are more Lady Dior art pieces coming out soon and I just wanted to quickly give you an overview. Can you please ask? Yeah. And you happen to be Romina? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah, I'm Romina. <laughs> oh, you, you know me? <laughs> I saw um, um, a vlog about your Tenerife something. Oh, at my Tenerife vlog. Oh, yeah. no. <laughs> Just because I, I really like Tenerife. Oh my god, yeah, yeah, yeah. We just came back like a week ago. And I was going to watch your back collection as yeah. well, but oh. it was in my, you know, watch later. Yeah, 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 definitely. Yeah, watch it. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Wow, guys. I mean, that is incredible. This is incredible. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Such I think that special. one should be in like medium size. Though. Yeah, such a special piece. They come up with so many collaborations. Oh my god. Oh nine. This is so beautiful. I love that one. That one is. This awesome. is a mini, right? Yes. I think it should be. Yeah. It's either a mini or yeah. small. It couldn't be more. Oh, 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 oh. This is so me. <laughs> oh god. I think this is even nicer than than that one. I mean, let me know, guys, what you think. But I think this is so me. It's got the rose, right? It got. It's got something. Yeah, because your name is Rose. Mm, yeah, right? exactly. <laughs> Oh my god, when are they coming out? Do we know uh, that? They're going to come out soon, but I cannot give you the exact date. Yeah, yeah. However, if you really want it, you we, could reserve it. We can start taking the deposit now. Okay. Because nice. the moment that we receive the deposit, it's actually saying, you know, like, yeah. it's, like it's, it's confirmed, so it should come quicker. Amazing. It's so many this time around. Usually you had around six or something, right? That came out at a time. Oh wow. Yeah, but not all of them are going to be here. Ah, okay. That's why like I do say that if you so are really are, interested uh, in it, it's yeah. better to, you know. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I think you definitely have to send me the yes, screenshot yes. of the one with the rose. Yes, of course. Um, if you don't mind, I could take your contact later and yeah. I'll send it to okay, you. Okay, perfect. Later. That's amazing. Oh wow. It's so much eye candy. <laughs> feel like a kid in a candy store. <laughs> oh my god, guys, she was the loveliest SA ever. And she watches my videos. And she was like, oh my god, is it really you? Is it Romina? I just watched your Tenerife vlog and I loved it. And I was like, oh. 
<laughs> Thank you so much again, Doris, for helping me today. And she, I think she has found my ideal Dior bag. Um, that little one with the flowers, I'm gonna put it up there somewhere. I think it is so me and it's such a special, special piece. Like, I'm blown away. <laughs> so it's quite expensive. It's, I think, 11,000 pound. However, I think it's definitely gonna be worth it because they have like two of these bags in the entire world or so, you know? Okay, guys, so there's actually a queue, unfortunately. So that's probably not gonna happen today. So let's see what they have in the window display and upstairs as well. And this is new, right? And then we, yeah, we can't make it in today, I guess. Um, but maybe upstairs, most people actually don't know that there's a second Chanel upstairs and they're queuing down here. Um, yeah, poodle shoes, poodle shoes, poodle shoes. Not my favorite style. Okay, so what do we have here? That's Chanel in there, but they might stop me again from filming as soon as I go in there. So let's get some beautiful eye candy here. This? Have we not seen this last year? Did they bring it back or is that like a new model with a different material maybe? This jacket, I've seen it so many times and it is so so pretty with all the little decoration thingies um, on top. Yeah, nice nice nice. And these two beauties right here. Um, I think I'm gonna sneak around the other side now because they have two entrances. So let's get an overview of what they have at the moment um, before people stop us. So that's all we can see right from here. Um, a lot of purple colors, purple shades. I think it is really pretty. Okay, now it's only gonna be seconds and then they stop us. But oh, wow, I would wear that immediately. And what do we have here? Pretty. I love it. I love all those perfect little bags. Um, yeah, really nice. Saint Laurent for any Saint Laurent fans out there. And I don't know why, I, I know everybody makes those furry bags now, but they are so cute, they are growing on me. That's the Lulu, right? I'm not the YSL expert, but this, this color, this material, oh, it's like a little cloud. And some Gucci eye candy. This is a new bag. I've not seen this before. Music is mine. Okay. <laughs> this is available for pre-order. Let's see what other bags they have. It's nothing exciting anymore, is it? It's not really exciting at the moment. This is definitely a vintage piece that they reissued or I don't know, was it ever gone? Did they bring it back or was it just always there? I feel like, um, you know, everybody knows this model of course in the black leather body. Um, this is of course a new print. Do we like it? Do we not like it? Let me know. There's the matching wallet. Yeah, guys, I think that's it. So now I think let's still try and sneak into Louis Vuitton. Um, that's always pretty difficult here in Selfridges as well because they want to stop you immediately. Um, it's almost as tough as getting into Chanel. Okay, so a little sneak peek in terms of what they've got on display at the moment. I don't know how long I'm gonna... Oh, I can't believe it! They have it! <gasps> they have the Papillon trunk and the monogram here. I know I just reduced my entire monogram collection, but... <gasps> I only ever saw this in the Epi leather, never in this version. I think it was pretty rare, right? I can't believe they got them back in. And for all you on the go lovers out there, this is the PM size, the teeny tiniest little size. I always, I'm always surprised how tiny it actually is. This is the GM, of course, and then you have the MM, um, which is right in the middle of those. It comes with, a, oh yeah, it comes with a strap. Yes. Wow, it looks like such an heritage piece, right? It is. The place is also a trunk as well. And Louis Vuitton is known yeah. for making trunks. I know. So you have this, you really have a new piece of history. <laughs> exactly. I know. It's actually a little bit smaller um, than what I would have thought. Um, but it's it's cute. It's like you said, it's like the perfect evening bag, right? Exactly. Um, and it will fit everything you need in there for I that know. Evening. I can't, I can't believe I'm seeing it for the first <laughs> time. Does this belong to the for display only or is it available? Um, I can double check this yeah. if it has it in the display. The reason why it says display only yeah. is because sometimes when we get stuff, we 
Yeah. Okay, cool. Thank you. That is so nice, guys. I can't believe it. I mean, I know I said I'm basically done with Louis Vuitton monogram, and I've only got two or three pieces of monogram canvas left in my collection, plus vanille, of course, but vanille leather is a different story. Um, this is so gorgeous, and like she said, it is just a piece of, of Louis Vuitton history, of the trunk making process and everything. Oh, what do we think? This is so, 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 so pretty. You can either wear it basically, you know, with the beautiful brown leather on the outside or you can turn it around and you've got a monogram canvas strap, which is, of course, pretty nice that you can basically switch up the style. I think I would prefer this one, of course. It's such a thick strap as well. Usually I don't like thick straps that much, but I'm warming up to them. Of course, you can always attach a different strap as well. Oh, this is so, so nice. Yeah, it's such a nice piece. It's display of Oh, nice. Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> now I got it in my hands finally. <laughs> um, do you know if they take it like at some point into their usual stock and then um, it's going to become I don't available? Know when it was then. I just have to see like, when it can stop it. Is there a waiting and list already or could you text me? Yeah, if it, yeah? Oh, okay, good. Number, and as soon as we get yeah. one in, I can text you straight Okay, that would be amazing. Um, that would be amazing. Okay guys, so I really hope that you enjoyed today's video. I did not think that we would see so much eye candy. That is really incredible. So yeah, if you did enjoy it, please give it a thumbs up and yep, it's loud. <laughs> if you did enjoy it, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, join our little handbag of Zest family here because we all do have the same luxury disease. Yes, we do. And I see you again very, very soon. Bye.